welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new here My name is Kathleen and today I am bringing you guys a brand new video It is already vlogmas day 10 and it is unreal like it has been 10 days Although I may have missed vlogmas day 9 for that I am sorry But let's just pretend it never happened and move forward from here But alright guys in today's video I'm gonna be showing you guys my winter nighttime routine I've already done the winter morning routine for you guys But if you haven't seen that video yet be sure to check it out It'll be linked in the description box below So it is currently like 9 o'clock and I am craving hot chocolate every single night I drink at least one cup of hot chocolate, so that is where we're gonna start. Alright guys, so I got my hot chocolate, which means that I am officially ready to start this nighttime routine because this was crucial, but you know, everything else is more important. Actually, no, this is way more important, but you know what, let's just jump right into the video. So now that I'm prepared, I got my notebook here, and what I'm gonna do is actually reflect on how my day went today. Was it good? Was it bad? And like, just kind of talk about it and let it all out onto paper. So really just journaling, and I really like to do this because it really helped my head, honestly. I always have so many thoughts constantly running in the back of my head, so really writing it down helps me improve as a person and of course just clear my head and not stress out so much so I really do recommend reflecting on how your day went and journaling in general because it is really good for your mental health and just improving and bettering yourself one step at a time so that is exactly what I'm gonna do I'm gonna reflect on how today went and boy I'm gonna tell you I have a lot to write down because today wasn't the best but I'm also gonna write down a few goals for tomorrow so I can get them done and just have something running in the back of my mind and hopefully improve for tomorrow as well Alright guys, so I'm done. As you guys can see, I have like a whole page. I'm not gonna read my reflection, obviously, because that's a little bit more on the personal side for me. But to give you guys a little bit of a rundown, I haven't been feeling so myself lately. I'm not sure why. I just think it's my anxiety and what I've been feeling with Vlogmas and just overworking myself so much to the point where I'm not really resting as good and I haven't had time to do the things that I actually want to do other than film and edit. So really what I've been doing is not so good for my mental health, so I really need to improve on that and focus more on myself. Like, like how I'm actually feeling and just kind of listening to my body more so I also wrote down five goals and one of them is to obviously finish editing this video and have it up for vlogmas day 10 number two is to film more videos for you guys and really just get ahead of my schedule number three is to get better rest and take care of myself better obviously I have not been sleeping so good so I need to improve on that number four is to make time for the things that I want to do like I was saying and number five don't overwork I tend to do that so much I just feel like vlogmas is a very stressful time Especially if you do everything by yourself and you're a small youtuber and like it can really be discouraging So it gets to your head, but all right enough of that Let's move on to the next part of my nighttime routine All right guys the next step to my nighttime routine is honestly showering But first I don't just jump into the shower So I have this thing where I do it like once a week and it is that time of the week again So I use these two products So it's just Jamaican black castor oil and then the red pimento hair growth oil Don't know if I said that right, but that's what they are So it's just a hair treatment and your girl really needs a hair Hair treatment and I also need a trim like y'all I need to cut off like that much so what I do is I get this like little bowl and I just dump some in there I'm gonna just dump a little bit in there for now and then what I do is I honestly like part my hair well actually I don't even part my hair yet because my hair is literally middle parted anyways so what I do is I literally just start in the middle and then I work myself down and then yeah I just kind of cover my scalp and really get it in there and then you know do a little bit of my hair and that's really how it goes so that is how we are gonna go about this so what I do is is I like dip two fingers into the oil and then I just kind of like massage my scalp with it because that's really what you do you just get some oil and you massage it into your skull this is just like mental health taking care of yourself and looking greasy on camera like everything's good here I'm feeling myself all right guys literally look at this hair like oh my gosh anyways now I took some of this red pimento hair growth oil whatever and I'm gonna put it in my hair as well same kind of thing just repeat this is so relaxing now I just kind of put some on my hair all right so now that my hair is done and I'm looking ridiculous I'm gonna put it back all right just like that and yeah it is extremely messy and sticking up because of all of the oil but it's fine it's whatever so now I'm gonna leave this in for 30 minutes and probably go edit some of this footage and yeah
All right guys, I have been editing for like 30 minutes now. I am getting low-key tired. So now it is time to shower. All right guys, the lighting is like super bad up in here. But anyways, I'm gonna hop in the shower now. But I thought I'd show you at least my shampoo. So this is Shea Moisture. And it's also Jamaican oil, I think. Yeah, Jamaican black castor oil. Okay, I'd be going in on that Jamaican black castor oil. But anyways, this is for strengthening and restoring your hair. So that's what I use for now until I find something else because I do need to look for another shampoo just to like switch it out but anyways that is what we are using and I currently don't have any conditioner so that's why I can't show y'all my conditioner All right, guys, I just got out of the shower and I got dressed. As you guys saw, I have these, like, y'all can't see it anymore. The camera's too high up. But it's, like, Christmas pajamas. But, you know, I always throw on, like, a random big hoodie. That's just how I am. I love hoodies no matter what time of the year, honestly. So, yeah, after showering and everything, honestly, I feel, like, so much more relaxed. My hair smells amazing. I smell amazing. The next part is, honestly, moisturizing. So, I use this one, La Roche Posay. I don't know how to pronounce it exactly, but I think that's how you pronounce it. My skin is very sensitive so if I don't moisturize it I like break out or it won't exactly break out but it's like these like rashes on my face I don't know it's really not good I got it one time all over my face it was so bad and I had to go see a doctor about it and he was just like just moisturize your face and I was like like the doctor straight up called my skin dry but like it wasn't dry it's just I don't know that's literally all I do after the shower I'm not really good with that kind of stuff so like I never really know what to use Ugh, as you guys can tell my hair is literally like wavy slash curly slash all over the place slash frizzy slash like a damn mess so now I'm just gonna brush my teeth if you saw my morning routine you already know the process so you get your toothbrush and you only put a pea size amount and that is literally it and then you just brush your teeth all right, y'all, that is literally all I had to do in the bathroom. So I'm all cleaned up and looking kind of like weird. Like I never show myself with my natural hair, but it is what it is. So honestly, the night was like a mental health kind of night. So that being said, I'm going to watch some Netflix because I might as well chill out and do what I actually want to do because I haven't been doing what I want to do. All right, guys, I'm all ready for some Netflix. So what I'm going to be watching is, y'all probably can't see that, but it's Light Up the Sky with Black Pink. Y'all, I have been obsessed with these girls. Like honestly, I love their music and everything but now I kind of just want to learn more about these girls and it's like what better time than now so they have a documentary on Netflix and that's what we watching tonight all right guys I literally only watched like 30 minutes of the documentary right now and I'm getting sleepy so I'm probably gonna end the video here because after this I'm probably gonna pass out anyways but so far y'all go check out Blackpink light up the sky documentary on Netflix it is so good the girls are incredible and it really shows in this documentary all the things they went through as a trainee and all that stuff but alright guys this was honestly a healthy nighttime routine for me this is usually what I do but lately I haven't been doing it so it's felt nice to go back to how I used to go about my night always take care of your mental health take care of yourself and do good things for yourself treat yourself do what you gotta do to feel good inside but other than that guys that's gonna be a wrap for my nighttime routine i hope you did enjoy it if you did be sure to smash that like button for me and if you're not already subscribed be sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on your post notifications because i'm posting every day up until christmas and hopefully i won't miss any more days but other than that guys thank you so much for watching and i'll catch you guys tomorrow peace yeah. no. 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 No.